One local community is taking on a utility powerhouse. I'm Tanika Hughes. I'm John Bachman. Families say they are concerned over a JEA project that would install hundreds of power poles next to their homes. Action News Jack's Beth Rousseau is live in Bartram Springs. Beth, the plan is halted right now because of that opposition. And a discussion about this is about to get underway in less than an hour here at Bartram Springs Elementary School. But what I want to do right now is walk you right over here and show you this sign. There are dozens of them throughout this neighborhood. Families tell me they have plenty of concerns to speak with these JEA leaders about. Smita Sinha has been living in this Bartram Springs home long enough to see plenty of additions to the area. The Home Depot came, the Walmart came, mm -hmm. and there are more uh, shops coming up. A change she's not in favor of is JEA's electric reliability project. This is a map of where the company plans to install 103 new electric poles and a nine mile power line along US 1 and Racetrack Road. We don't want that because that will. Uh, you know, dip our property prices, which that is number one. And number two is, of course, it's sore to an eye. Those are concerns also listed in this petition against the project. It has more than 1,300 signatures. As a buyer, if someone comes and look at it, may, I may have difficulty selling my property. This video on JEA's website details the plans. It says the poles by Bartram Springs won't be visible from the development since they're leaving the tree barrier. We've highlighted the portion of trees the company says they'll be removing. Neighbors tell me they still have other concerns. Uh, it will be a safety issue having a high tension wire running. Now, this meeting, we're already seeing people file in for the discussion. It starts at 6.30, runs through 8.30. We're going to update for you on Action News Jacks at 10. We're live in Bartram Springs. Beth Russo, CBS 47, Action News Jacks.